Welcome to today's video, okay? It's all about this makeup look for your last day of school. When it comes to the last day of school, I have like two different personalities. In between like either or, it's either like straight bum or a little bit put together, okay? Just for school. So if you are new to my channel, make sure you all subscribe. So, yeah. Also, if you want to know more about what I do beyond YouTube, the best thing that you all could do is follow me on Instagram because I update my Instagram stories like no tomorrow. Ooh, I want to show you all these bamboos I got. They're so pretty. I'm like still looking for a perfect vase for these. I have them in a mason jar <laughs> right now and it's just not my style. It's more of like a rustic look. So I'm trying to find like a nice glass vase. I'm just so obsessed with having like plants and clear vases but thumbs up if you all like my... <laughs> My bamboo plants. Anyways, I'm talking for like 10 years. Why am I talking for so long? Like, no, let's get into this video and don't wash my hair because we're gonna do that at the end of the video. And yeah, so I just did my eyebrows. I filled them in lightly and I just used the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the color, what did I use? Ebony, I think. I tried doing my eyebrows a lot more soft than usual. For me personally, I think that for school is not like going out like all out glam look it's just something subtle but looks well anyway so for my eyes now i'm going to use the milani eyeshadow primer in the color 01 nude and i'm going to put that on my eyelids put a little bit and let me tell you with milani this eyeshadow primer here it's kind of annoying i don't know if this is just like all eyeshadow primers so with this eyeshadow primer you have to blend it as soon as you apply it because if you don't blend it in as soon as you apply it it is going to like stay on your face in the same exact spot that you applied it and it's gonna be like so difficult to blend okay and of course we're gonna set it and today I'm using my Laura Mercier powder and I'm just gonna set it on my eyelids so I pat it in and then the excess, I just brush away. Okay, so after doing that, I am going to go on with a brown. Of course, I'm gonna apply that on my crease. No, I'm not applying that on my crease. I'm applying that on my brow bone, okay? Men's are sorry if the lighting changes, okay? Okay, so after doing my crease, I'm gonna go on with a dark brown. Ooh, cool. Ooh, cool. And I'm gonna put that in my crease. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a red, and I'm gonna put this red on my crease as well. It's coming out like purpley pink, but so we'll just work with it. So if you have like a purpley pink in your palette, I guess you can use that, but I don't, it looks red from my eyes, but I could be wrong. Okay, so once you're done, you're gonna get your brush once again, and you're just gonna diffuse out the edges, if you want. Okay, so basically that's how that part of the eye looked, and the only thing that we're gonna add on to this is a shimmer, like a shimmery brown, and it's from this palette, the blush nudes, of course. I'm gonna wet my brush because, like, I don't want it, like, blinging. I just want something subtle, but something people be like, oh, you look so good. Why is this turning pink on my... Doesn't that look pink? Anyway, so this is how the eyes look right now. Okay, definitely don't be like me. Make sure you all set your eyebrow. Okay, so I'm gonna be using Maybelline Bra Brow Drama and I am just gonna lock in my eyebrows because when you're at school you want your eyebrows to be set in place. I'm gonna prep our eyelashes and I'm using the D Wispy lashes and I'm just gonna put those on for today. And if you all want a like full video on like my favorite beauty supply store lashes, I'm gonna link that down below because I have like four of my favorite beauty supply store lashes. Okay, so while my eyelashes are trying to get tacky, I'm gonna go in and prep my real lashes, okay? I'm using mascara. Okay, so today for foundation, I'm using the Fit Me Foundation uh, Matte and Poreless and I'm using the color Toffee Caramel. This is such, look at this beauty blender. I love the color yellow. Well, it's, I think it's a real technique, a bootleg sponge. This is so tough. Like, who's really putting this on their face? I got this from the beauty supply store. Because <laughs> I was like, let me try it out. The color is pretty. 
So I slowly got it because of the pretty color. I'm gonna use my LA Girl Pro Conceal. I'm gonna put it underneath my eyes and on all the highlighted areas. Man, I don't know if my nose is just fat and wide, but I always now have to start putting concealer on the side crease of my nose. <laughs> this concealer, this is the HD Concealer by Nika K. And this is in dark brown. And I'm just gonna apply this. Great! Okay, so now we're gonna set everything on my face. And I'm just using the L'Oreal Infallible Matte. L'Oreal Infallible Matte Foundation Powder. I look so weird. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna use the Laura Mercy uh, translucent powder and I'm just gonna set around my mouth and under my eyes. Okay, while all that's settling in, we're gonna go in with the colors that I put in my crease underneath my eyes. So after blending that, <laughs> powder is getting in my nose. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with the brown pencil and I'm just gonna tight line my waterline. Okay, I'm gonna take off all this because man's ain't trying to turn white. Okay. Okay, hopefully this looks good together. I'm using the Annabelle Eye Wrap Pencil in the color Auburn, and I'm just gonna put that around my lips, and then I'm gonna go and fill my lips with the Sephora Cream Lip Stain, and this is in the color 13. So I'm just gonna go and do my hair. So basically this is the end of the finished makeup look, and I feel like this is so perfect for school, for the last date, if you wanna just put in a little something something for people to see you and notice you a little bit more. As you can see, all of my makeup looks are so simple and easy, like anyone can do them. So if you all really like this makeup look, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Like you'll see a lot more of me and my videos. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Au revoir.